always a special occasion when His Majesty visits us in the United States. This 75 years we've seen the strengthening the ties between our two countries, which have benefited not only America and Jordan, but, but the global community, particularly in the Middle East. Jordan's leadership has been so extraordinary in providing pathways to peace. Sometimes, you know, you need to have someone that can tell you what you don't want to hear. Uh, and so, but you want that honesty. And so he tells us at times what we don't want to hear. Uh, I've learned to rely upon him to give uh, the truth, uh, to give his thoughts and his opinions and his recommendations on how we can make the world a better place for all of us. Uh, his leadership is outstanding. Um, his vision is outstanding. Uh, we, every time that we sit uh, with His Majesty, uh, we have greater optimism uh, of what can occur in the region. A two-state solution is inevitable. The question is, when will we have it? Peace is not made between friends. Peace is made between enemies. And there's no better time to say that it's time to make peace and to move away from being enemies than right now. Jordan has a very stabilizing effect on the region, but it is a partner that is critical to the United States in making sure that we help maintain stability in that region. Uh, it would be virtually impossible for us to do without Jordan's partnership. The relationship between the United States and Jordan is just absolutely one of the most important and substantial relationships that the United States has.